Hey guys, I wanna, uh, I saw some of you guys before. My name's Johnny Alexander. I played, uh, back from uh, 89 to 92 and coached for four years. Seven years or so. And, uh, obviously got a lot of pride in the, in the program here. We've been trying to do a little more with the alumni to kind of say thanks to, you know, you guys for all the efforts you do. And some, uh, some stuff with the shoes and some other things. And we're gonna try to keep stuff right up as we go along. And, uh, but I want to say thanks for you guys even just coming out here today. It's, it's a real, you know, I just want to thank you for us. You, know, you guys did that. It's getting ready, but it's kind of nice. Yeah. 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 We'll be cheering here and hard from you for this afternoon and the rest of the season. So I know we should have, at least those at RSVP, will be here in about, you know, about, probably about 30 here this weekend. They're getting back in, which is a pretty decent show this weekend. Um, I know we've got a couple guys we've got flying in from Minnesota next weekend into the Raleigh area. He and I are going to be driving over to Red Bull me too. Over the high point game, so we're gonna to try to keep stepping up and get some, get some support. There. That game's televised, by the way. Oh, is it? And I'd like to say real quick, Johnny, if I could interrupt um, for a moment, we would like to thank you guys for all of your support. And guys, if we could give them a round of applause. Your, your, your connection, I know many of you have, have, have given your, 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 your time and your money to help the guys have some things that maybe we wouldn't be able to afford uh, normally, and it, and it doesn't go um, unnoticed. The rain jackets the guys are wearing and the shoes are, are something that um, you guys provided for us this year, so we're certainly very, very thankful and glad that you take the time to come back. So thanks. Trying to really start again, so like when you guys get done, you guys got a platform you can come back every year and try to catch up with some of the other generations. It's something that just puts a little more tradition in what's going on here. So I'm looking forward to come back to you. So we're probably trying to do a, a fall thing every year. Probably going to try to do the first home weekend game every year. But we're kind of kind of gearing forward, and then we'll do a spring game kind of at the end of the spring season where we, fall will be kind of alumni versus alumni. I don't want to mess with you guys in the field. And then the spring will be probably a little alumni alumni, but get a chance to play against the young boys too. So get some kickbacks in. Um, like I said, my name is John. I'm living up. Uh, I live in Pittsburgh right now. I know we've got a couple more in the Pittsburgh. Of course. Here, here, yeah, I live next door to the Kelsey's. Oh, no. I live right in the, the cold second. Oh, 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 yeah. There we go. Oh, yeah. Some stories there I want to hear. Okay. So, anyway, kind of fun to live next door. I've been down in Pittsburgh. Um, got two little ones, doing a little real estate development. I want to get a chance to. Everybody's kind of interested. So you get a feel for where the alumni is, where they're from, and kind of what years they play. So, when we start down here, amazing. But yeah, first, it's a treat to be out here, guys. Um, we had away trips and we lost the ball. It depended. Um, it determined whether we went to McDonald's or Ryan Steakhouse. So it was. It was. We were dealing with scraps back then. So it really is a treat for us to come back. I just want to let you guys know that. My name's Mark Mays. I was in from like '86 to '96. Don't ask. The red shirt. I think we were just cutting out. But, uh, I don't. I don't want to date. I don't want to date myself too much. So it was just in that era. But uh, I live in Charlotte. I have two little boys, four and two, and um, and I've been in Charlotte the last 14 years. And I went to high school, Asheville High, here and played at UNC Asheville. Andrew Heath, I was the goalie from the 99 to 03. Um, from the Wilmington now, married, returning, married, much more than boring than I used to be. <laughs> I finished in 97. Uh, I've been upon a little now home for me. <laughs> um, but not really, it's uh, good to be back. Thanks, Matt, for having us. And thanks to John and everybody for putting us together. Um, Jeremy was done from the season 98 to 2001. Um, guys, this is the first time I've had a chance to come back. I've been calling a long time since 2001. So it's great to be back and see you guys. Obviously, we're going to take the game and everything. So, best of luck today. I'm actually going to Charlotte. I'm married. I have one daughter. And another daughter. Dave Cave, I'm from Charleston, uh, on the road, I was here in 94 to 97. Uh, one, one, one little note for you guys, uh, before our practice and games, the whole team used to line up on the sideline and we'd have to walk across this field and pick up rocks and sticks. <laughs> you guys, this is nice, I didn't know how this is going to be pretty easy, but uh, you know, I enjoyed it, thanks for having me out. Hey guys, I'm Brian.
price for my place from 2000 to 2004. I grew up in Arena. Um, now I live in Raleigh. My name is Mike Eichner, I'm uh, from Atlanta, <coughs> graduated, uh, we got Canadian for 89, 85 to 89. I did. Uh, Mark McGee I played here from 85 to 88, so yeah, I was just quite your age. Uh, came from Camp Lejeune, North Carolina, so I think there's somebody on the team from Jacksonville. Old stomping around, I lived in Jacksonville six different times. Yeah, <laughs> um, in Atlanta now, uh, played soccer with this guy since we were freshmen, so look around, you're going to have some of the people that they're sitting next to you, you're going to be friends for life, you like it or not. <laughs> um, words of wisdom, learn from the experience and enjoy the situation because it goes by really fast. You guys have a great thing that's building year over year here. Enjoy it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's been cool for me for playing. You know, I can kind of hard imagine like it's been like 18 years and I may look it, but I don't feel it. You know, <laughs> you know get a chance to play and coach with these guys. And uh, McGee and Eichner were uh, just before I got here. Like, like this year, it was my, 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 my freshman year. But I got a chance to know these. It's kind of the thing, you know, you get playing some after, you know, afterwards, you got to know some of the guys. And it's, but he's right. These are the guys. I mean, look around. These guys you'll be talking to. Like we, I talked to these guys 20 years later. You know, so enjoy it. You know, have fun. It goes by fast, man. And just tell you what, man. Take advantage of every 90 minutes. Right? How about we do this? We need two. Oh, I'm on it. Oh, oh. I'm on it. I'm already. Coach, I'm already ready. <laughs> okay, step in, you go. That's time. What, Stem? Yeah. He's the best going on three times in the first two minutes he was in. What? What? I shut up. I'm gonna put my jacket back on. Put me in, Kelly. Come on. <laughs> you like more of techniques over there. You like what Lassie does. <laughs> if you want to look over here, these are the two worst goalkeepers in the history of Western North Carolina. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, your dog is not showing competitive maturity. He wants to play. That's what he wants. You trained him well, Joe. Is that good there, Joe? Wow. Best way to be Too easy. easy. You got it. You got it. You got it. You got
Two, three, cheese. American cheese. <laughs> <laughs> get, get, get two or three, Jan, and we'll be done. Go do a little Photoshop. It's a lot of Photoshop. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thank you, Jan. In addition to the national team lineup, I'm interested <laughs> to hear about your game winning volley. To secure a 7-6 victory. Would you like to comment you know, we on let, that? We, let the, we kept it close for a little to make it dramatic. And then, uh, you know, just old, old hat really is what it comes down to. So, you know, the dog gets lucky every day. So. How, how about a message for Steve Cornish in Faribault, Minnesota? Stevie, hope you got a warm coat left over from your previous years up there. We miss you, though.